Another Wisconsin winter inching ever closer now. We know it and we love it for the great outdoor activities, but the snow and the cold can pose, of course, some serious dangers to the safety of everyone in Wisconsin, which is why this week is Winter Weather Awareness Week. Let's check in with first alert meteorologist Amanda Morgan to step in with more. Good morning, Amanda. Yeah, hey there, Tim. We're starting off Winter Weather Awareness Week today by talking about the winter weather alerts that we typically see as we're tracking snowy systems, and you'll see these issued uh, by the National Weather Service in the coming months. Let's start with the lowest impact, and that's a winter weather advisory. It's typically issued when we're expecting around four inches of snow, maybe a little bit more. This is one where you might want to add a little bit of extra commute time or a little bit of extra drive time, but as we get towards a winter storm warning, that's when school might be canceled or you might want to work from home if you have that opportunity. That's when we're expecting snow six inches or more, a relatively high impact system there. Now for a blizzard warning actually has nothing to do with the amount of snow we're expecting it has to do with visibility and impacts on the roadways visibility under a quarter mile for multiple hours. We actually haven't had a blizzard warning in Dane County since back in 2018, but we do have lots of winter weather advisories in a typical winter. We'll have to see what this winter has in store for us in the coming months here.